How do you read words that end in a consonant followed by an L and then an E? For example, like these two words. In this lesson, you will review how to read words ending with a consonant LE syllable by remembering the consonant LE syllable makes the UL sound like in table. Let's review. Consonant LE syllables come at the end of words. The LE makes the UL sound like in table. A common mistake when reading consonant LE words is making the E have the long E sound. So for example, reading this word as apple -y instead of as apple. Watch me while I try to figure out what word this is. First I'll try to just sound it out based on the letters I see. L, A, D, L, E. Latily. That doesn't sound right. It doesn't sound like a word that I know. But I remember that I can break words into syllables to read them, and I can use keywords to help me remember what sound different syllables make. So let's try again. First, let's look at this word from left to right. I see two vowels, so I know it must have two syllables. And I also see that it ends in a consonant, D, L, and E. So I know it's a consonant LE syllable. Let's break it between the A and the D. That way, I'm not breaking up the consonant LE syllable. Okay, now let's break it down syllable by syllable. Let's look at the first one. I see it's an open syllable. It has one vowel and it's the last letter, so it must make the long sound. Let's blend the sounds those letters make. L, A, lay. Okay, now I'm gonna look at the second syllable. This one is a consonant LE syllable. I know that D makes the D sound, and because I remember the keyword table for consonant LE syllables, I remember that the LE makes the UL sound. If I blend those sounds together, I get D, UL, DO. Now I can blend the first syllable with the second to read the word. Lay, dull, ladle. Here are the steps I just did to read ladle. First, I looked at the word from left to right. I noticed that it had two vowels, so it must be two syllables. When I did that, I also noticed that it had a consonant L, E at the end. And I remembered that L, E makes the UL sound like in the word table. Then I blended the sounds in each syllable and then blended the two syllables together to read the word. Let's try another. First, let's look at the word from left to right. I see two vowels, so I know it must have two syllables. I see that it ends in G-L-E, which I know is a consonant L-E syllable. So I'm gonna break it up between the R and the G. Okay, now I'm gonna break this word down syllable by syllable. Let's look at the first one first. I know that G makes the G sound and UR makes the ER sound. If I blend those together, then this one sounds like G, ER, GER. Now I'm gonna look at the second syllable. I remember that it's a consonant LE syllable and LE makes the UL sound like in table. I see a G which says G and then the LE. If I blend those together, then this syllable sounds like G, UL, GO. Now I can blend the first syllable with the second to read the word. Gurgle. Gurgle. Here are the steps I just did to read gurgle. They're the same steps I used to read ladle. First, I looked at the word from left to right. I noticed that it had two vowels, so it must be two syllables. When I did that, I also noticed it had a consonant LE syllable. And I remember that the LE makes the UL sound like in table. Then, I blended the sounds in each syllable, and then blended the two syllables together to read the word. In this lesson, you have reviewed how to read words ending with the consonant LE syllable by remembering the consonant LE makes the UL sound like in table.